Hi guys, welcome to the news diaries. So today we have come with a video on how to make Nehru cap and a rose. So let's see how to make them. First, take a piece of cloth and measure the length as 20 and width as 18. Now, take that piece of cloth and fold it in half. And make sure it is even and there shouldn't be any pieces or any parts of the cloth coming out. Try to make it as perfect as possible. Now, take that part and fold it as shown. Then, take one part and fold it over the part which we just folded. Then, pinch and turn it and the step is done. You will be able to get a small part between the folds. Now, once more, fold that piece of cloth in half and just uh, press on that part so we can mark the correct center. Then, uh, from that point, fold it like a triangle in both the sides. Now turn it over and do the same. Now fold one time as shown. Now fold it the same part once more until you get a triangle between that folds and the triangle which we just made. Now in, turn it and make two folds in the manner. It would be a little bit tricky as we are using cloth. Now do the same fold as we did in the other side. Now we will be able to see some pockets on both the sides of that part. Now we have to fold and then that end tuck it inside the pocket. And make sure you have tucked it in properly otherwise this uh, Nehru cap may fall apart when you are using it. Now just open it and you will see that the cap is ready. Now let's make the rose. So for making our rose, we need a square paper of a red color or any color which you want to make your rose with. Then you need a scissors. Then you need some glue. I would suggest Fevicol but you can take any glue which you have. So let's see how to make it. Take your paper, your square sheet and cut a circle out of it. Okay, so I have got the shape which I want. Now, next we need to take this circle and cut it a bit thick. Like this, in a circle. As you can see, I am leaving some width and not going to the sides. We have to leave some width for the flower. Don't cut it too thin, then it won't become proper. But don't all the way do that, okay? Uh, at last you have to leave a small circle there in the inside as well. But don't leave this much big. It should be about a medium or kind of small. It's kind of like going in a spiral, so just go until okay. So I think this can be a stop. So then you'll get a kind of spiral.
okay so now the next thing which you have to take is take it this pointed part and start rolling it you have to do it all the way all the way down the spiral You can use any color which you like if you want to make a white or pink or yellow rose or so you can do it in any color which you like This is one of the simplest ways to make a rose as well as it would look beautiful This part uh, you should not uh, spiral it up in other rows only the other part you have to do that Okay only till this end you can see the only till that part and then you get the step of rows then you can see this part this part you have to glue it up in So the rose is ready and I have also included a copper wire here so this way if you want you can uh, you know put it on your coat or anything whichever one you want to put this on you can also if you want you can make a paper stem and include this and it will be a perfect rose so that is a finished rose.